Hello, welcome to this week's Asian American Spotlight. It's not really cold. I'm I'm in Vienna right now. I'm wearing my jacket because I just took a shower. I was gonna head to bed, so I'm naked. But I wanted to make this before I flew off back to Vancouver, and then I wouldn't have time to do this. So too much information. Anyways. Let me talk about this week's Asian American Spotlight, which is on an organization called Represent Us Now, or the acronym RUN. So RUN is an organization that seeks to unify Asian Americans or, or their allies um, and kind of help us grow political power and, you know, just help organize us and give us cultural and political power, so to speak. So it, they've got some really fascinating numbers here. Um, we are the, Asian Americans are the largest growing um, like group in America. There's more than 21 million Asian Americans out there. Um, and we are also the least likely to vote for a, numer a, a number of reasons. Um, but that should not... That should not be. Basically, if we if we don't p participate in the democratic system, we are left not being heard, you know. And we're kind of giving away that freedom that we 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 came here for. Um, so it's a very important thing to go out there and vote, exercise your voice, whatever it may be, wherever you might stand, um, to have a voice so that people can start, you know, politicians can. Uh, businesses can start catering to us. Um, so here's some interesting facts about Asian Americans that I did not know and some of you might not have known. Um, our Asian American Pacific Islanders purchasing power is expected to top $1 trillion by 2018. That is insane. Um, that would make the Asian American Pacific Islanders the 19th largest economy in the world. That's pretty good. Um, so yeah, we have an incredible amount of spending power. There's a lot of us. Uh, we just need to go out there and start supporting the things that we want to support. And then our voices can be heard just a little bit more. Um, so again, this is uh, this is an organization that seeks to do that. It um, it helps educate people. It helps. Uh, they they run a bunch of they run they run a bunch of events um, all over the United States. You can. You can create your own event and they will help support you. Um, and it's a gathering place of Asian Americans from all backgrounds. There's po political uh, people, there's entertainers, um, actors, musicians, you name it, um, all coming together to kind of try to organize ourselves and try to just, yeah, just to come together as a group and have our voices be heard. And that's a really cool thing. So if this is something that interests you at all, um, check out the website, run, R-U-N-A-A-P-I dot org. Um, I mean, I'll have a link right there. Uh, click on it, sign up for the newsletters, and if you're in the neighborhood for one of the events, go check it out. Um, see if it interests you. If you're, I mean, if you're interested in running for politics, if you have strong views on issues and you want to learn more about it, now's the time to get involved. Um, again, wherever you stand on, on the political spectrum, if you believe something, you know, if you, if you believe in it and, and you want to make, you know, the country a better place, now's the time to get involved. Now's the time to step up and not just assume that someone else will get around to it. What better place to start than now and who better to do it than you? No, there's no one. It's you. It's me. It's you. We got to do this and we got to do this now. So um, get to it. And that is the Asian American Spotlight brought to you by Vienna, the city I'll be leaving in four hours. I'll see you next week.